Oof. Okay. Jewels and stones. You're given strings, jewels, representing the types of stones that are jewels and stones, representing the stones that you have. You want to know how many of the stones you have are also jewels. So if the jewels are lowercase a and capital A, and we have these stones, well, then only the first three are jewels. So we would return three. That makes sense. Okay, so we have zero jewels to begin with. We will loop through the string of stones and say if that stone is a jewel, if it's in the jewel string, then we have one more stone that's a jewel. And at the end, we would return our answer. Dab time, baby. Okay, wearing pants on my arms, that's just a pretty normal thing to do here, and oh, I see what he's doing. This is actually a time complexity of big O of S times J, where there's S stones and J jewels. I can actually write this in S plus J time by writing jewels as a set, or a hash set. This makes the lookup O of 1. I'm awesome!